Hey guys, welcome back to another video on the channel. And today I've got a really quick tutorial on how you can stabilize shaky video clips in iMovie. So here with me, I've got a really short uh, 10 second video clip of kind of just a camera panning over a plate of food. And if you look closely, it's clearly very shaky and there's a lot of movement from side to side and it's not a very stable shot. However, on iMovie, there's a really quick and easy fix to stabilize this video clip. The first step is to click on the desired video clip that you would like to stabilize. Then you want to go over here to the top where there's a bunch of options for editing the video clip and you want to click on this icon right here, which is the stabilization icon. Then you want to go down here to the left and check mark this box, which is stabilize shaky video. Now, depending on how long your video clip is, it may take five to 10 seconds. It can even take up to 30 seconds if it's a very long video clip. Once this is checkmarked, if you play the video, you'll see that automatically it's much more stable in the movement and there's not much uh, side to side or horizontal movement. And if you look closely right here, it's already at 33%. That's kind of default setting. If you want to smoothen the video even more, you can uh, bump it up all the way to 100%. And now if we watch this video clip, it's almost completely still and there's almost zero horizontal motion and it's very stabilized. So how uh, smooth you want it, you can change that using toggling this bar over here to 100% um, to 20%, depending on what kind of video you want it to come out to be. And that's pretty much it. That's how you were able to stabilize shaky video clips in iMovie. Once again, the steps are just click on your desired video clip, click on this icon up here, check mark this box and then you can toggle it from zero to 100 percent depending on how smooth you want the video to be if you guys enjoyed this video make sure to leave a like and comment below if there's any uh, suggestions for future videos you'd like to see and if you want to see more helpful tutorials like this in the future make sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell and with that being said i'll see you guys in the next video peace